Dumpty Kids in the Discovery where we laugh and play. <laughs> Hi everyone. Hi. Okay, so today we wanted to tell you about something really fun. Oh yeah? What is it? What do you mean? I thought we talked about this. Oh yeah, okay, okay. Alright, so um, we just saw our dentist and she said that there's four things you can do every day to take care of your teeth and your gums and we wanted to tell you all about it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so first, every time you eat you have to switch your teeth with water and you have to brush your teeth two times a day and uh, um, oh yeah, floss, floss your teeth every night and one more thing something about sticky things oh yeah so try not to eat sticky stuff as much as possible like the sticky candy and those kind of sticky things stuff yes mm, because they also call cavity oh yeah 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 <laughs> okay so i kind of little bit forgot but maybe we can get our dentist to tell us one more time. What do you guys think? I think it's a good idea. I think so too. All right, let's get our dentist. All right, let's sit here and get her again. Okay. Wow, that was great. Hi guys and hello to you too. You know, I overheard you and I think you did a great job remembering the things I said. What do you guys think? Thank you. Uh, but can you tell us everything one more time? I kind of forgot a little bit. Can you tell us again? <laughs> yes, I think that's a great idea. I think we should go over these four important things you can do every day to take care of your teeth and your gums. Right? Uh, yeah. All right. So, number one, every time you finish eating, try to swish your teeth with water. Get a glass of water. Just like that. That way you get rid of a lot of the food that are just sitting around our teeth. And after some time, they turn to this sticky, gooey thing called plaque, which is not so good for our teeth or for our gums. You can do the same thing every time you drink something sugary like juice, which is also not so good for us. And we'll talk about that some more later too. So what do you guys think? Do you think you can try to swish your teeth every time you finish eating or drinking something? I hope so. Yeah, I'm going to switch my teeth for sure. Yeah, me too. I'm going to switch my teeth. Uh, actually, can you remind me in case I forget? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to remember. And if I forget, you remind me too. Okay. Number two, make sure that you brush your teeth two times a day and very well before you go to sleep. I know it's really fun to brush your own teeth and you should definitely learn to do it yourself. But do you know what? You should really let your parents or your caregivers to brush your teeth before you go to bed especially because you don't want to leave any food around your teeth. Because if you do, these little small sugar bugs, well they're really called bacteria, that going to sit on the teeth and start to eat the food and your teeth. And they cause these little black holes called cavities, which nobody wants, right? Oh. I don't want cavity. I don't want cavity. No, no. I hate cavity. I, I hate cavity. That's right. Nobody likes to have cavities, right? We don't want cavity. We don't no, want cavity. We don't, we don't want, cavity. want cavity. No, no oh. cavity. Right. Okay, then. So make sure that you really brush your teeth all around and everywhere and you're not leaving any food behind. We're going to talk about how to brush your teeth correctly next time. Okay. Number three, make sure that you floss your teeth at least once a day, especially before you go to bed. Because even if you do a great job brushing your teeth, there are still going to be food and bacteria. Those sugar bugs we talked about that causes black holes called cavity, remember that? They're still going to be between our teeth unless we floss. So make sure you do that. Ask your parents or caregivers to also floss your teeth. So you take a piece of floss and you floss in between your teeth. So next time, I'm gonna teach you exactly how to floss your teeth. Actually, I love flossing my teeth. Yeah, me too. I do, it's, uh, it's easier than brushing sometimes. Yeah, it is, because once you know how to do it, it's very fast. 
and that's why we like it right yeah <laughs> and number four try not to eat sticky snacks as much as possible they are terrible for your teeth those sticky snacks like candy and chocolate potato chips even dried fruits they're not so good for our teeth they get stuck inside of the groove of our teeth and cause cavities remember cavities those black holes which nobody wants that's right so you should try to eat your fruits and your vegetables drink your milk and all the good things that are good for your teeth and for your body actually i like eating vegetables and fruits too my mom always tells me to eat my fruits and vegetables and and i like it i love it i love it actually i love it i feel super good when i do sometimes i eat like the bad stuff but I'm going to try not to anymore. Yeah, me too. How about this? Next time, we're going to talk all about these four steps so you really understand what to do and what not to do to take care of your teeth. What yes. do you guys think? Yes, 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 Great, yes, yes. right? Yeah. Oh, and I almost forgot the bonus tip. So make sure that at least once or twice a year you visit your dentist so she or he can check your teeth and see how well you've been taking care of them and if you have any questions you can ask your dentist and you know what if you do take care of your teeth it is very fun to go visit a dentist do you guys agree yeah I love going to the dentist yeah and if you open your mouth like this wow you're gonna get a toy at the end too yeah, I love the toys. <laughs> Me too. Mm -hmm. Well, okay, guys. It was so nice to see you. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 <laughs>